So welcome back to the third and final gameplay video with Minnesota United. And we are still in Division 1, we are seeking the title. And we are gonna need to win to stay in the title race. We are in need of three wins out of three matches. So we lost in the previous match 6-2 to two against the Irish Republic. And uh, yeah, let's skip ahead to the matchmaking. So our defense was exposed big time in the previous match. And we don't have any we don't have any ways to counter that. The defense is bad. And we don't have all that much speed. So when we face a team like the Irish team in the previous match, we just outruns us on counters, we have no chance. Okay, so we face Ayakio or Ayakio. There we go, nice. Hey, what happened there? No, again, we are exposed in behind. Look how simple it can be done. It just... No one is following the run, doing anything to prevent that goal. They're just walking in line with each other. Okay. Okay, this is gonna be a disaster, I feel like. What is going on here? Oh, come on. Pragapane. Ah, oh my God. Look at the pace of this guy. <sighs> the animations go so quickly sometimes. I didn't... I wasn't aware I had beat him. And I was by him. I was already... Controlling my player backwards. When I realized. No, 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 no! Who is doing what here? No one is defending, that is for sure. 
Oh mein Gott. What is this, bro? What the actual hell is going on? Can we come back here? Do you think we can realistically come back? Still early and everything, but... I don't know, I don't know. This defense feels so... Like, in the first match we had a little bit of control of our opponent with the defense, but I feel like in the Ireland match and this match so far, very little control over anything. Okay, we got the ball back here. If we get the next goal, maybe this guy gets a little bit nervous. Can we see if we can do something here? Oh my god, what's going on with him? Amarilla! Okay, bro, what? It's so weird because I never see that happen for my opponent. Like, never ever does my opponent overhit a pass like that. It's nothing I do that makes that happen. It's like the game just decides, no, that pass is not gonna go. It's a simple pass as well. Come on now. We have no defense. It's incredible how bad this defense is. Then we have this slow motherfucker up top, Amarilla. Oof. Come on.
Okay, we're gonna do Reynoso and we're gonna do Lord. We're not gonna do freaking Ariaga in this one because that was a disaster in the previous match. Lawrence, uh, let's do the speedy guy up top, Garcia. We need a miracle. It feels horrible. The defense feels absolutely horrible. Look at this. Look at them. Oh my god, look at the touches. Oh, for fuck's sake. No, bro. No, bro. No, bro. Chaos again, it's chaos. Total chaos. Oh my god, it was incredible. We're supposed to lose the ball. It's like there's nothing we can do to keep the ball here. No, oh, 
it's too slow. Everything is so freaking slow. Oh my god. Finally. Let's go. Okay, we need to win the ball back off the kickoff not let him have the ball and most importantly he can't score on the kickoff we need to get it back and we need to have control of the ball 10 minutes remaining he might just pass it around at the back here because he seems like the guy to do that let's see if we can get it let's go It's too slow. So slow. How am I still in control of the ball? Who knows? No, what a horrible finish! No! He's stacking the middle here. So difficult to break through in the middle. Hey, hey, hey! Free kick! Fuck! So annoying! Should have gone full attacking probably. To get more players inside the box. Like no one was doing anything to threaten like the, the back line there. So that effectively ends our season. <laughs> We had to win to have a chance at the title and we lose so we are done playing with Minnesota. The only bright bright spot on this team, Fragapane, he was freaking amazing. But we talked about it even before we started playing with Minnesota that even the defense it looked so slow, like none of the fullbacks had a good speed. It was like, a, on paper, it looked like a horrible team to play with. But uh, still, it went a little bit above expectations, to be honest, just because of Fragapane. I didn't know that he was this good. But that was pretty much it in terms of bright spots. So... is. Minnesota better or worse to play with than Houston Dynamo? Well, I'm going to rate Minnesota like a tad above Houston Dynamo. Like, 
not much, but simply a tad just because of Fragapane and that's it. But both those teams definitely at the bottom of the tire list so far in terms of, in terms of playability. So that's going to be it for the Minnesota gameplay and this ends season 32 I think it is, 32 or 33. So next season we're going to start with a new team, play three matches and which team that's going to be, stay tuned to find out. So thanks for watching, stay safe and take care until the next one. I'll see you then.